Hey, pleasant good evening. This is Sports Fan News. I'm Drew Borg, and this is going to be the next video on the Olympic Women's Preliminary Tournament over there as Team USA took down Finland 5-1. to The Finns are a very good team. And, of course, have done good in the World Championships and probably, honestly, even though I'm an American saying this, but could have had a good chance to win the one with that unallowed goal, even though I shouldn't be the one uh, saying that point. But uh, on to this game. Um, they don't have their goalie, uh, Ratu, in net because she had a disagreement with the coaches. Uh, she obviously does immensely great things for uh, growing hockey in Finland, Ratu does, and she uh, does a very good job at growing hockey in the States amongst the women as well. Um, but when it comes to the overall game, um, the U.S., like Japan, was really able to push the offensive memo and went by the old adage of any shots, a great shot, just get shots on net, is obviously they also got great scoring opportunities by Kendall's Coin Schofield, who was a player of this game, um, as well as others in uh, Carpenter as well. And then Rooney played absolutely fantastic in net as she absolutely shut them down. The one goal looked like, at first, maybe the goal from the point uh, could have been a little bit at her fault, but then when you looked at it again, uh, it, it looked like it was just a very perfectly placed shot uh, that ended up getting through uh, at that point, uh, where it was just a point wrister, uh, where she picked the right spot, it was the right height, fired it perfectly on that, it was a post in where at initial glance it looked like that might be one that really went back, and then at second glance it looked like one that was just a very nice a shot by Tapani there as she was able to really wire that off of the post. But the U.S. team, they pushed the pace ex extensively in this game and really did a great job in my eyes. I have to give them AA for the way that they really played this game to win 5-1. There's a lot of something to, um, or 5-2, to two, excuse me, uh, in this game as Tapani was able to score, of course, the other goal um, for Finland uh, as well. Uh, later in the game to make it 5-2. to two. So Timpani is a player of the game for Finland. She was noticeable on the ice all night, and she was able to get their two goals in their limited uh, shot total and play really well for them. But for the U.S., Kendall Coyne Schofield uh, played absolutely uh, fantastic. Um, the one thing we have to look out for um, before I get into breaking down the goals real quick and to wrap up this video is... Uh, Brianna Decker did, our first line center, did get banged up in this game. Hopefully she's okay going forward. It didn't look good. You can hear a lot of stuff without the um, fans there, and you could hear the agony of the injury, so hopefully she's fine. But Kessel, uh, Phil Kessel's sister, was able to make a very nice move in front of the net and get it past uh, the five-hole um, <clears throat> there of the goaltender, um, Casella and uh, get it past her five-hole there and get it in. And then Kendall Coyne Schofield sniped one on the blocker side, medium high shot in the second on that uh, rush that they had going into the zone. And then she also had, after that, a very nice deflection goal uh, that she was able to have uh, put in where Hillary Knight also was able to set up in front of the net and uh, really help out on the screen uh, because you have two of the best players in the world in front of the net. Uh, that are able to really do well deflection-wise and do well net from present tries, two completely different sizes. That's going to draw the defense to one side, and it pulled them to Kendall Coyne Schofield's side, and then she was able to uh, get the goal. Um, Carpenter also had a very nice wrist shot goal in the first period, so she's a player of the game, potting two goals in this game. Kendall Coyne Schofield is a top two player of the game as well. And then just for the way um, that... They were able to battle and stay in the game, even with the amount of shots. She did allow five goals. I would have to throw it out there to Gasala just for being able to stay in this game, just keep staying poised in this game because she was getting absolutely shellacked by the U.S. and by Coins Cofield, by Hillary Knight, um, by Decker before the um, injury, and by Carpenter the entire night. That it's um, honestly amazing they didn't have more than five goals in this game. She still have to give a shout out to Casilla, but uh, when it comes to the player, of the game uh, for Finland, uh, that would be Timpani, where she was able to wire home both of the goals. Kendall Quinn Schofield was able to carry the weight. The captain played great, led the team with poise and great energy this entire game. And then Carpenter stepped up and had a fantastic game overall. And Comper also looked good. Uh, JT Comper's um, um, sister as well also looked good in that game uh, as well. So I think this was a very good overall game 
play by the Americans, I would give them an A in terms of their performance in this game. Got to keep building. Finland's a very good team to beat at first. Did they have their top goaltender? Not necessarily, but they still had a very good one in Kasala, and she played well. Where um, would Ratu have maybe kept them in this game more? Yeah, because she's more of like the um, carry Price woman-level goaltender that could really stand on your head and win a game for you. But I don't think Kasala lost this game by any stretch. Finland was just outmatched the entire game. The U.S. pushed the offense of Annie, and they were able to win this game. So have a great save and play day, buddy. Peace out. Stay safe out there. Enjoy the rest of the Olympic hockey. I'll be doing more reactions on it as well as the Canada uh, trouncing that I haven't had a chance to do a video on. I'll do a quick one on that later this evening. Peace out. Stay safe and enjoy the hockey. And please you can subscribe down below or up above on the easiest widget to help us get the 200 by the end of February. Thanks all. And also check out the Hockey Writers Inc. show that will be coming out on Steel Flyers. Just type in Steel Flyers flyers to YouTube tomorrow that I did with Lance Cream. Peace out, everybody.